how to use a VPN on an iPad. In this video, I'm gonna show you several different VPN options that you can use on any iPad, and I'll even show you a free VPN that is highly trusted. And if this video helps you, please consider giving it a like, and also subscribe to my channel, because that really helps me out. So to get started, I'm just gonna show you how to set up a VPN in the settings, but then I'll show you an easier way to do it where you download an app and it simply does the VPN setup for you. So first, open the settings on your iPad, and then you wanna make sure general selected in the left menu, and once in general, scroll down all the way to the bottom and you'll see VPN and device management. From here, if you need to set up a VPN for work or school, something like that, you can sign in to that account and set it up this way. Now, if you're just trying to use a VPN for personal use, it's much easier to do this through the App Store. And I'll show you a couple different VPNs. Check the description for discounts to these VPNs. And then I'll even show you a free VPN that I trust and I think that is very trustworthy. So first we have NordVPN. Very easy to set up, you simply install it, log in. This is a paid VPN, so you'll have to purchase a subscription with them, and then you would simply hit a button, and you can configure your VPN for different locations if you wanna be able to get more shows on Netflix, things like that. Another VPN I would recommend is ExpressVPN. This is another paid VPN, but you get a lot of different locations that you can log into, and the app is very easy. Once you purchase a subscription, you would simply hit that little power button right there, and the VPN will be automatically enabled for you. Now, if you're looking for a free VPN that's just as easy, I would recommend and Proton VPN. This is one of the most highly trusted VPNs in the world and they do have a free option that works great. And check the description, I'll have a direct link to this in the App Store, but you simply would select Git and it will go ahead and download and install Proton VPN. Once it's done downloading, just open it up and the first thing you need to do is either create an account or sign in. But remember, they do have a free option so you don't have to pay anything. Go ahead and create your account. I'm just gonna sign into my account. So once you get in, you'll see free connections, just select connect. Then you just need to select allow so that Proton VPN can configure a VPN within the settings on your iPhone automatically. So select allow. You'll need to enter your passcode. Then once you do that, it'll bring you back to Proton VPN and you'll be automatically connected to their VPN. You'll know you're connected to a VPN because in the top right of your iPad, it'll say VPN. And all we have to do to turn off the VPN if we don't want to use it anymore is simply open up the Proton app and select disconnect. Or you can turn it off in the control menu by swiping down from the top right of your iPad and then selecting this section right here and you'll see VPN, select that and that will turn off the VPN and disconnect it. You can also reconnect anytime to Proton VPN by simply selecting that, and then it will reconnect the VPN automatically. So that's how you use a VPN on an iPad. If this video helped you, give it a thumbs up, and please consider subscribing to my channel.